Holy shit! I didn't realize Isabella was fighting a bigger guy. Probably you should have done, right. done that. The blade can be too soft. Quenching the steel is Jesus a Christ. step that can make <laughs> What are they talking point. about? Right. A blade for every purpose. What do you think about blades? I'm sorry, Captain. I drifted off a bit. Right. Of course. <laughs> Evelyn, come on. <sighs> painful. <laughs> this is honestly really painful to watch. <laughs> Evelyn, please. He likes a girl with some backbone. That's why he doesn't like me. Fuck that dude. I don't like the looks of this. No, no guys, guys, there's a trap. Did I trigger the trap? I'll deal with it. I love how we have casually met slavers, Mubari, and uh, thieves all on this one path. Like, do they all just like hang around each other? Like, oh hey, look, the slavers are, are in town. Just like, there's the front stab, back stab. I think that's what I have to call it from now on. The front stab, back stab. It's where you stab them in the front, but it's called the back stab because logic. Is that a mage? That is a mage. Okay, now that's pretty cool. I'm gonna go kill this mage just before it fucks up everything. Oh, he's not dead. Now he's dead. I wasn't able to one-shot him. I'm pretty sure I can just hit R and like auto loot. I didn't realize this for like the longest time. Unless I got some gauntlets of some kind. Not sure if they're gonna be any good, but can I interact with everything with R or just no, it's just Whoa, loot. Guardsman. Good patrol. I think we're done and I What's up? What a surprise. What are you doing here? Aveline. Hawk, don't. So bring me later. I'll come around once it's all out in the open. Would someone please tell me what's going on? She likes your face. You're a daft couple of. Oh, take a hint and bend her over a basin, will you? <laughs> Captain. Uh. I should get back to the barracks. <laughs> I thought we were friends. Friends sometimes push. I, I have to fix this. You'll file a complaint. Ask for a transfer. Evelyn, just you, calm down. You're coming to the barracks to explain why you put him on the spot. Double time, Hawk, or so help me. She's gonna hate me. God damn it, Evelyn. Oh no, I guess not. Look, Evelyn. He told me that his type is people with backbones. Because apparently I don't have a fucking backbone. Uh, <laughs> Am I salty about that? Kind of. Not because he not only misunderstood what was going on, but the fact that he's like, I'm not, you're not my type. You're kind of fucking ugly. I was like, oh, oh, well, that's, that's a double whammy right there. Dad and Aveline didn't, you know, do anything. She didn't come out and explain what the fuck's going on. I'm totally finishing this quest right now. We didn't even go talk to the, uh, the Arl? Was it the Arl that I need to go talk to? Is it even an Arl? I forgot who it is. Uh, the Viscount. Viscount Dumar, obviously, because this is the Viscount. I didn't even go talk to him. I was more interested in this, like, weird, adorable relationship she has. That I had to keep pushing her to go, to go into. Maker. Where is Donic? I have to head this off before it goes to the Viscount. Maybe a formal apology. Something that shows the guards they can still trust me. I suggest awkward gifts. No, I'll be, I, I, I won't joke around this time. I'll be like, they'll to understand. A captain, not a golem. They expect you to have feelings. Not if they get in the way of the job. You don't know that. I won't be that stupid again. <clears throat> My apologies, Sarah Hawk, but I need a moment with the captain. Guardsman, 
Donic. Please. Not your type. What the fuck does that mean? <laughs> Fight me, Donic. We're just like <laughs> casually. She's giggling. They're not. They're not doing it, right? <laughs> they wouldn't just do it in there, right? Aveline. Guardsman Donick did not file a complaint. No shit. This was all incredibly stupid, and you made it wonderful. <laughs> it certainly was Finally stupid. Finally mastered the obvious. I'll take your word on the second part. You'll get the chance. I was mute, and now I want to sing. Please don't. I just... There's no way I can ever repay you. Perhaps it's simple. Thank you. Hey, can I ask you something? Was there a moment when you thought I was beyond help? <laughs> you don't need to know. <laughs> beyond help? Neither. Nah, Not for you a second. Always, you could always you don't use lie help. Very well. <laughs> as far as you know. Shout when you need me, Hawk. I'll always be here for you. Just knock first. Aveline plus ten, and she looks like she still has things to talk about. It's a fine suit. The finest. Break it down. Distribute it. The <laughs> Viscount requires parade armor for his inspections. Then stuff it and mount it where he can see it. I wear the uniform of the guard. His Excellency will not be pleased. His Excellency can mount it. <laughs> hey oh. Sounds like you're having Trouble fun. Hawk? You say that like you expect it. You don't know the half of it. And why don't you, by the way? Why aren't you tail deep in the problems of this city? <laughs> sure, you do good. But petition a title. Take a job. The guard is always looking. You're the captain, not me. Just... <laughs> don't blame me for not being you. I'd make a poor guard. I take well, bribes left and right. <laughs> I don't really see you taking my orders. Besides, you won't catch me saying you don't have an effect. You've certainly had one on Hightown. But maybe it's time to get serious before the option isn't your own. <laughs> you need my good my, my good humor. You don't want me as sour and dour as you. You need a counterpoint. I don't think I've asked to be made the butt of your jokes. <laughs> Donnick. <laughs> okay. Too Sometimes I have asked for it. I do wish there was more time for levity. It comes so easy to you. Maybe a little too easy. That's all I'm saying. Everything plus 15. How close are we becoming friends? Ah, eh, pretty close. Still wish there was uh, numbers or something to track that. It just seems really annoying when it's like, oh, well, you're like... You're like almost there on the meter. It's like, but how close? Is there like a specific number that I need to hit? If I hit that number, do I keep the perks or does it go down? Like, how does this work? You gotta, you gotta explain this stuff to me. You can't just be like, ah, oh, just eyeball it. <laughs> You'll be fine. It's like, no, don't. I don't want to eyeball things. Just tell me like it is. Have I opened this complex chest before? Guess not. <laughs> I mean, obviously it's still locked, but what up? Years of nice, quiet anxiety gone, <laughs> along with a whole street. An accident on purpose, more or less. Right. A mad elf pushed by zealots, likely hidden in the very groups I have to appease. The maker has a grand sense of humor. I can go murder those people if you want. The Irish <laughs> I suspected he had no plans to leave. I didn't know it was just as annoying for him. <laughs> what doesn't annoy him? Just don't give in to the zealots. Keep the worst of them off his back, and it'll be all right. But that is the problem. It has already escalated, despite your efforts. A shame. 
God damn it. Do I want to hear what happened? Probably. The Kanari delegate and entourage paid me a visit. It was civil, tentative, hopeful. They left my chambers with precision, but were not reported by the outer guard. They are missing almost literally from my doorstep. Oh shit. What really? What do you imagine will be the Arishok's reaction? I'll find out what happened. get out in front of this, and fast. I feel I've been trying to turn a stampede for some time now. Someone is pushing very hard. A little too hard. Speak with Seneschal Bran. Then you will see why I cannot trust anyone else with this. I don't know who would benefit from fighting the Kunari, but it will cost all of us. Three gold. Good day, Sarah. Good day. Seneschal, what the fuck's going on? You have information about the missing Kunari. I am to help you, yes. Viscount Dumas would appreciate discretion in this matter. He always seems to appreciate discretion. Involved at all, but that is neither <clears throat> here nor there. Fight me, <laughs> fight me, dude. Uh, were they vulnerable somehow? I'm having a hard time picturing the abduction of a Kunari entourage. <clears throat> Unfortunately, they were not at their best. Their swords were tied into their sheaths, as I advised. Oh, it seemed a risk. That's not suspicious. Compromise. Even I know you cannot separate a Kunari from his weapon. Does the Arishak know yet? Has anyone reported this to the Kunari? Make her no. I'd be signing the messenger's death warrant. He'll find out soon enough, of course. And when he does, the Viscount is rightly concerned that the illusion of peace will dissolve. All right. Could this be a Kunari yeah, plot? I doubt it, but violent. he might want an excuse to end this peace. I suspect that if the Arishok wanted to take over, he simply would. Yeah, because he's that kind of guy. We fear that heretical Kuhn of his. Its demands have done more to keep him in check than any of our efforts. Besides, would Kunari stoop to trickery? There is no precedent, but there is unfortunate evidence of influence on our side. Yeah, you guys are assholes. You seem reluctant to look. It sounds like you don't want them found. The fuck's I up with that? Think of what is best for the Viscount's office. Oh, Bringing of course. Attention to such an incident benefits no one. You would do nothing. The Kunari are neutral hostiles at best. There is no relationship to salvage by overextending ourselves on their behalf. All right, tell me what what too much I'm you know. I'm sure you have suspicions about what happened. My concerns are well founded. This could not have escaped the notice of the city guard, unless they were involved. Hold up, Avalyn. Have failed to report? Several. You should start with one of them. Although where you find a swordsman so eager to sell his honor and duty, I'm sure I don't know. The hanged man. <laughs> hanged man. Got to be. <laughs> right. Wow. Then you know what to look for. <laughs> Everyone's just like, yeah, the bar. Occurred without notice. There is always a weak link. Please keep this quiet. The Viscount is under enough scrutiny as it is. <laughs> I love how Meryl is just like, yeah, they hang, man. Yep, yep. Mm -hmm. I mean, obviously, where else would you go besides the bar? Uh, Meryl's home. Uh, I'm going to go to the docks first to uh, hopefully finish up this, this side quest of how to frame a Templar. We've been doing it for some time now, and I just haven't actually finished it. Uh, what the fuck was that? A bunch of elves. Okay. I don't think the alien edge is around here, so I was... Is it? Hold on. No. I was saying... I, I was wondering if I could go over and talk to, to Meryl. But I guess not, so... Which so, is unfortunate. How good is Donic? Is he cocksure? Just get it out of your system. Did he curl your toes? Dwarf your beard? Arl your eman? Jesus. Shake your jewelry? Praise your maker? How about satisfy a demand of your kyun? Yes, all right. He's an incredibly proficient lover. Happy? Well, that's rather personal, don't you think? <laughs> Shut up, Isabel. <laughs> Can't do it. All right, Kurt Mr. Paul's Selby. It's a dangerous place for our friends, but you've made their lot easier. Several of them put their coin together to get you this. 
Ooh, just a gold. Oh. <laughs> when she said get you this, I assumed like it was an item, but it was not. Uh, sell some junk. Some four pieces of junk. I have like so much loot that I just don't know what to do with it, and I'm too lazy to go through all of it and like try and find the the best loot. Because I know whatever I'm going to be equipping, people are going to be like, that's not the best one. The one below it's actually better for your class. What the fuck are you doing? It's like, ugh. I just, I just want to finish. I'm not dying. That's, that's good. I can, I can accomplish that much. But it's more than I can say about the, the first game. First game I was like, dying every five minutes. It was bad. 